What's up, YouTube? Welcome to SB252. It's your man, Kurt. Thanks for watching the video. Please make sure to like this video and subscribe. So today, we're going to talk about a man that is absolutely incredible. We're going to talk about Messi for Barcelona. And a big shout out because this video was requested. I thank you for requesting this video. Please keep watching. So, appreciate it. Listen, Messi is only five foot seven, guys. I mean, he is so small that he has a good equilibrium. I can't even say the word, man. He has a good equilibrium, and he gets to stay close to the ground, so he can just, he's shifty. Listen, I used to have to play a guy in soccer when I was back in high school, and I played this guy that was short, and he is amazing when you stay close to the ground he can weave in and out of defenders and he got quick bursts man if you have never seen him play you got to see him play he's kind of like the russell westbrook of soccer he is so aggressive he just goes straight at people he's got three defenders on him he'll fake one way fake the other way and then go down the lane and he'll attack the goalie after that and just Kick the ball right inside the net. The reason why he's only five foot seven is because when he was younger, he had a hormone deficiency, and he had to take hormone um, injections, which were like expensive for him. I mean, now he's he's rich. He makes five thousand dollar, five thousand euros a week these days because he just re-signed and sign a four-year contract with Barcelona. But he didn't have that kind of money back then. He didn't have that much money back then. So he couldn't afford those hormones. But the team, Barcelona, when he was 13 years old, he decided to go and all the way to Spain, and they signed him to a youth Barcelona team. So his whole family moved all the way to, from Argentina all the way out to Spain and quickly this man earned himself up the ranks and made the Barcelona team by the age of 16 and ever since this man has not looked back he's got champion league championship and he's got La Liga championship in 2010 and in 2011 and then in 2012 I believe he had the best year of his career when he set record after record after record after record I mean he, if he just keeps, I don't know how long he's going to have because he's not that 16-year-old boy that came into the league. Now he's a 30-year-old man. So it's hard to say how long he's going to continue to be great. But, man, I, I don't know how someone can do some of the stuff he does. Just, uh, I mean, with people all over him, grabbing all over him, he just goes through him and just put, goes, he's aggressive at his size. I mean, he used to get hurt all the time, a lot. But he's found a way. He's like an Iron Man. He just doesn't get hurt anymore. Not much. I mean, although last year he did suffer a groin injury. He was out for a couple weeks. I mean, that was unfortunate. <laughs> That's painful. But other than that, he stayed fairly healthy. I mean, and now he doesn't play for the Argentina national team anymore. So that's going to help him be able to focus more on Barcelona rather than having to play for the national team and play for both. But it's very unfortunate that he never won a FIFA championship. And he didn't really win championships, FIFA or any championships, really, for the national team of Argentina. And I know the home natives of that country really wanted to see him win one. It's unfortunate he never got one. That's really the only knock he has on his resume. He's got all the stats. He's got championships for Barcelona. He just never got a title for his home country which is really a shame and that's why I don't think that doesn't make that's why he's not the greatest of all time because if you want to be the greatest of all time you've got to win championships from where you're from that's the way I feel about it so listen he he is amazing guys he's amazing listen thanks for watching the video let me know do you think you can be considered the greatest of all time if you only win championships 
for a country that is not your native country and you never win one for your native country so listen he's gonna keep going he's a great player and peace thanks for watching the video